Welcome to Technical Studies. Plate squaring is very important for all construction related jobs, especially for pressure vessel and tank fabrication. In this video, I will show you how to square a plate in the correct method. Provide proper supports and level the plate. With a right angle, find a krona that is obtuse angle. Make sure the leg of the right angle is parallel to the side of the plate. This corner is an obtuse angle, let us check the other corner. This corner is an acute angle. Go to the first corner. First, we will mark a straight line, 8 to 12 millimeters, from the edge of the plate. I am marking 10 millimeters here. Go to the other end of the plate and mark 10 millimeters. Hold tight a piano wire or a line thread through this marking on both ends. To prevent the piano wire from touching the plate, place some packing below the wire, such as a nut, a piece of plate, etc. As shown, place a small right angle on the plate and move it as close as you can to the piano wire without touching it. Draw a mark on the plate. Like this, draw a mark in every 2 meters. Draw lines, connecting these marks. A straight line that spans the entire length of the plate has been drawn. Since, the size of the plate we are going to mark is, 2500 mm by 5300 mm, let us calculate the diagonal of the plate. Mark 10 millimeters back from the plate's edge. Draw a small arc of 2500 millimeters as shown. Mark 5300 millimeters to the other end of the plate. Starting from this corner, draw a diagonal arc of 5,860 mm to the opposite corner and cut the previous arc. Draw a line connecting these marks. Mark the width 2500 mm on the plate, or whatever the required size, on both ends of the plate. Hold the piano wire on these lines, and draw a line, as previously done. Mark the length of the plate on the other side of the plate and check the diagonals. If both the diagonals are in the acceptable limit, usually plus 2 or minus 2, draw the line.
always calculate the diagonal of the plate before starting the marking. Thank you for watching.